Hey, family, it's SE. All right, you guys. Let's get back to these Portland cement decors. Okay, so I had finished two. Does she look cute? She got eyes and nose and lips now. Okay, that is my second one. All right, you guys, and these are my last two. So, y'all know it's an easy process. I already broke it down to y'all. See how he's she's almost finished. So, I got to do her eyes and her lips and her nose. So, let me get to that one. So, you guys, look. Y'all know I'm a crafter, right? So, I found these. Um... What was I looking for? I was in my... Oh, I know what I was getting. I was getting some paint. Right? For the eyes and the lips and stuff. And this is acrylic paint. But I'll get back to the paint. So you can get these pack of eyes for like two bucks. Make sure y'all pull up a 40% off coupon off a regular price. Pay about two dollars and some change. Or maybe a dollar and some change. But, um... Yeah, so I thought these would be really cute. Because I was going to paint the eyes on... And I said, you know what? These will be so cute. And um, so I picked up a bag. But what I was um, in there for was the paint. So what I decided to do was do the, uh, paint the eyes and the lips. But um, one thing I wanted to stress. So let me show y'all the pack. This pack was like $4. Again, pull a coupon 40% off. Get that coupon online. And this one had uh, 12 colors. And this is acrylic paint. But um, when you get the acrylic paint, if you decide to paint your, your um, cement ladybug, make sure you get um, acrylic paint with some gloss. That was the only thing about that paint. Because, see, I had used the spray can to spray mines on, so it gave it that nice shimmer, right? Um, and, again, that's that paint from Walmart that cost about $4.50. So, you know, it's a simple process. Hopefully this ain't dry up. I'm hoping it didn't dry up. Crazy glue. Just glue your eyes on. Or if you got to, um, I couldn't find, it's somewhere in there. I just couldn't find it. My uh, glue gun, the hot glue gun, you could use a hot glue gun as well. So most of you, you people that are crafters, and even if you're not a crafter, you're probably familiar with the glue gun. So, you just stick the eyes on. Like so. Give it some time to dry. Reveal your eyes. <laughs> and I'm going to actually put the eyes on the other one since I'm doing eyes right now. So, I can finish up the eyes. And I still got to put um, the little polka dots on it, see? And again, this is such a, a nice little project to do with your, your little ones, your grandchildren. Your grandchildren and your little ones, they will love doing this. Essie clowning over there. She is so funny. Okay. So that one needs the uh, polka dot. And let me put this up. And my glue. And let's see. That over there. And I'm going to do the little eyelashes first. gonna come out different I haven't decided you know what I need to figure out where I'm gonna put them in the yard I think I know where let's see 
And if you don't have little paint brushes, you can always get these from like Michaels or um, Michaels or Hobby Lobby. She needs another lash. Don't y'all be laughing at me. I just thought these would be so cute in the yard. It's so much, it's so much, um, I kind of botched that, but that's okay. It's so much, um, nice, uh, cement projects that you can do and put in your yard. It's another one that I'm going to get to. If I don't get to it this week, I'll get to it next week. Because there's some other stuff that I want to do, um, maybe tomorrow. I know I'm not going to do it on, um, Nah, I don't think I'm going to do it on Friday because I have to get ready for another event. And I don't like to do a lot of gardening work um, on Fridays, especially after leaving the shop and getting ready for events on Saturday. I, I don't like to do too much. Let's see. But once I get to it, I will definitely bring you guys some footage. I hope you guys are trying this and making your own little ladybugs. Because they are so cute. Let's see. She's going to have a tight nose. I forgot to spread her a little bit to make her nose. Let's see. Oh, she got one. So yeah, you can get all this stuff from um, Lowe's or Hobby Lobby. And you can get like the spray paint. You can get that from there as well, but I got mine from Walmart. And you can get it from the dollar store too. Family Dollar. Dollar General. They have this kind of stuff as well. Little paint, little paint kits, uh, kits. And little um how you call it um spray bottles uh can uh can of spray they have all this stuff there too so i shop everywhere okay let me take some of that that white paint or and this acrylic paint easy to wash off compared to uh spray paint so can't really mess nothing up with this it'll, it'll wash right on off so no worries there especially if you're doing it with your little um your little ones so she don't have a lot of space so i'm just gonna give her a little tiny little mouth because she don't have a, little, a lot of space oh She go. She look cute. She got a little V mouth. See? She look cute. Let's see if we can give her. She got a little bit more room, so give her a big old smile yeah shoot it was um very muggy today it's feeling good now but it was super muggy today from the rain we got uh, rain uh, late yet la yesterday, late evening, and I think we might get some more tomorrow. All right. This 
<laughs> so only thing I gotta do with that one is put her little dots on it. Well pretty much she's done. But um it's easy to put the dots on. You just use your little brush, just dab it in the um paint, just spot it up. Very easy peasy, you guys. Don't she look cute? So I got three complete ones. There's my little little one. There is my other big one that has the, the big old dent in the middle of it, but she still look cute. See? Don't she look cute? But she look like she she looked mad and this one looks she looks cute. This one look like, what are you doing? <laughs> uh as a matter of fact, let me see if I can. Hold on, what is that over there? Oh, that's what it is. Let me enhance her. Oh, cool. I saw an army truck in the neighborhood. I don't know what an army truck would be doing in the neighborhood. Oh, that's what I had to do. Let me en let me enhance her little her little um point. Okay. you guys that's what she needed she she a little crooked but she just needed some thick lips <laughs> yeah she had a little chip on the side but she'd be fine let me set her over here so she could dry and tidy up all that ruckus back there but I know I saw an army dead one truck in here okay just want to put an extra coat on there all right you guys so I hope you guys enjoyed these videos on how to make your um, Portland cement um, ladybugs for your garden decor. And I'm going to put those back. And there they are. She's so cute. Alright you guys. I hope you all enjoyed those videos. So you guys can go make y'all some um, cement ladybugs and put them out in your yard. And make your yard look pretty with all the different colors. And you don't have to do red. You could do um, black ladybug. You could do green ladybug. Um, what other color ladybugs come in yellow you can do yellow i'll probably do some yellow but um for right now i think i finished my task with ladybugs for right now maybe as time go on i'll add um some more colors but i think they're so cute and i do have an idea where i'm gonna put them at so when i um uh, finish doing some some other projects around the yard i'll fill you guys in on where i put them at okay so this is Essie the Gardener. Thumbs up, like, subscribe, hit that notification button. Thank you for all my new subscribers. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Uh, thank you for all my shout outs, you guys. Thank you, I appreciate you guys so much in the garden community. And I hope everyone is doing well. I hope everybody is harvesting. And um, I just hope everybody just have a abundant harvest this year. Okay, you guys, so this is Essie. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Mink, say hi. Say hi, Mink. Mink, Mink, say hi. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace.